Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to uh, downgrade to different updates into Project Playtime. I did a similar video to that, except that showed you how to go to old destroy toys. So this video is going to be about just how to get around to different stuff and everything. So let's get started with this video. The first step is you want to open uh, Google Chrome. And then uh, this will be in the description, but you're going to want to copy this, which will be popping up on screen right now. You want to go ahead and paste that into your browser. I can't think of the name. Uh, and then press enter. Also make sure that you have Steam open, by the way. Uh, it's gonna say open Steam. A website wants to open this application. You press open Steam. This is going to open you to the Steam console. Now what you're going to want to do is that I'm going to have every update depot in the description. Um, I organize them too, so I have different names uh, that show where it will take you. So let's just do phase two, uh, anti-cheat. So once you copy that, you want to go down here, paste it in, and then enter. This for me takes about 30 minutes to download, but once it's done uh, downloading, then it will say uh, download complete or whatever, and then uh, you, uh, and then I'll pick up from there. Once it's done uh, downloading. You want to copy this in between the quotation marks, in between. Copy it, and then you want to go to library. Uh, you can either right click on project here and go to manage, or you can uh, be like me, I use the gear, and go to manage and browse through local game files. Either way, it works, but I like to use the gear. Anyways, once the game is open, you should see all of these files. These are your phase three files. Uh, then on your keyboard you want to press Windows E now up here in the little uh, Thing here you want to You want to click on it and then control V and then enter These are going to be your phase 3 files so to change them You want to go back to here you want to select all of these and delete them it's okay because all of your stuff will still save in phase three so don't you don't have to worry uh then you can highlight all of these and then bring them over into your poppy playtime multiplayer files and let this uh do its thing all right so as you can see everything has been brung over uh to here now you can exit out of these and open your project if it says, uh, if the game says it's updating, you probably did something wrong, but try it again and it should work. And then you just press play and then, uh, you should be in phase, uh, two. And then boom, your game should load up perfectly fine like this. Um, you're in obviously phase two, so obviously Misfit is not going to be here. Um, your mommy skin is not going to be here, your, uh, little veggie guy is not going to be here, so, um, so just be aware of that. So, but yeah, have fun when you're in here. Oh, and by the way, one last thing, when you are going to go, uh, paste all of this into the, um, the Poppy Multiplayer files, uh, you select all of this, you don't select, like, half of it, you just gotta select all of it. So, I just thought I would share that just in case you guys get confused. Anyways, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next. See ya!